the moosh that you and Tweak were back here, he actually started to laugh a bit. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, those guys are back there? And he started to chuckle. I mean, I don't I mean, know what you want to take from that, but... <laughs> Tweak doesn't do commentary. I don't do commentary. So you have two non-commentary. I didn't do commentary people. when I started. Hmm? I didn't do commentary when I started. Yeah, but I'm just so darn bad <laughs> with commentary. I just take some learning. And not all. to mention, my advice and my things are very it's just unorthodox. Eh. I, I play weird characters, too. So we have Alf and Cloud. I'm happy he's using blue Alf because that's that's what I use when I play Alf. <laughs> And right now he's just playing that ranged game that I thought he was going to play originally, but... Uh, yeah, and look at these up there. Look at them go. Four, five, six. Mm. Oh my goodness. 67. What's, what's going on here? Oh my gosh. He does not care about that Pikmin. Yeah. I think that's the... That's the point. Mm. That's what you got to do. Just keep the pressure on the guy throwing him out. Take him out only when you can. And right now that is paying off for Vex in spades right now. He has... Basically, three times the amount of damage uh, that, Vash, uh, that Vex does. Just oop, oop, <laughs> take out that yellow Pikmin. Oh, uh, yeah, that yellow Pikmin <laughs> went down. He's very mad. Not getting back in the spaceship at night after that. I see a little bit of a surge here from... Uh, so now he's got, he's got somewhat of the dream team. You know, two purples and a blue. Mm. Red yeah. pops off off the side, though. Uh, look at that. He did not care about that blue pick. He got his damage in, though, so that's what counts. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> the dash attack, because it was on the platform, it actually does take out. <laughs> and he wipes all three clean, actually, there. Oh, no, he oh, still oh, has his blue. Okay. One, one's still there. Ooh, that was nice. Very nice aerial pressure. Right, trying so to clean might stock see here. Some, ooh, look at Coming that. Coming through with the, all right, charge climb hazard. Just keeping pressure off the side of the stage here, even up on top. Just he not ate away so much of that shield mm -hmm. on that platform. There's nothing he can do. He might as well just go straight to the ledge. <laughs> pressure again. Let's see if he can air dodge appropriately. No, nope. uh, sitting there. Yeah, it's the one danger I, of that recovery. I call that a little bit of destruction. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit of destruction. I don't know if uh, Logic knows, you know, what to do against Cloud. Mm. And I thought before, like I said, he was gonna just take out those Pikmin with neutral, but he's just, you know, just letting them slap. You know. Yeah, I mean, you're not the target. Vex proved me wrong. I thought that it may have been better if he went, you know, DK. But mm. we'll see if he swaps though, because like he does Maybe like colors. He went colors. He's mad. <laughs> he went red. He is mad. He's a mad owl. All right. Join the Empire instead of the Rebellion. And it begins, guys. Is it another destruction? What will we see? Pretty even so far, but uh, mm -hmm. Vex is starting to gain a little I don't bit know. of traction. When it comes looking at stage control, it looks like Vex is all over it. Oops. Ooh, all right. I like it. Forward smash coming through. Able to bring him right back on par with damage. Right now, yeah, he's not playing. He's able to back off a lot more. He's playing a lot more defensively. Yeah. He's understanding this matchup. I don't know what happened game one, but he, he's getting it now. Mm. Just letting the Pikmin do their work, and actually, even though Vex is just shrugging them off, that's... The oh, no, Tech and No, bounce. but don't worry, don't worry. Oh, he was able to... Alf, Alf can get back. Yeah. You know, they, they have that, that kind of recovery where... Oh! Not that time, though! No. No, what's <laughs> going on here? Because I know he was going to throw out another down air. I was surprised he uh, got that uh, snap, too. But then that third one just sent him down. Just that constant pressure with the up air. Oh, oh man. Oh, wow. I thought he was uh, free to grab him after that, but he came through with the, uh, the slide. Recovery's going to be a little bit of an issue for Alf here. Mm. And now, I wonder the more the uh, the more Pikmin he has on him when he recovers with up E, does that, like, weigh him down at all? Yes, it does. Oh, wow, okay. A nice I mechanic. think Vex might take him with him. Nope. The forward smash. He's not going silently right now. I mean, Alf can rack up damage, but 80% is a uh, tall order. And it's just make it that he's light as well. Mm, that's true. Cloud's not weak. 
Nice grab, nice pivot grab. Yeah. And again, he's playing just like before, letting the Pikmin do a good amount of the work and just moving in when he can. And getting a brunt more damage, just about halfway on percentage. The, oh yeah, that's very uh, interesting. If he throws out a Pikmin, it will collide with the Blade Beam. So he can't rely on that all too much. And almost takes him out. And <laughs> he's just about on percentage too. What's happening? Oh my gosh, and what a reversal from Logic on that round. Oh man. That was this. incredible. Now, I'm not. I'm just gonna throw this out here. Mm -hmm. Cloud was not dead. I will throw that out there. Cloud was not dead. You think he could use the uh, first part of the he, cross slash? Yes, if yeah. he used side B, he would have made it back. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, we take them, but you know, a little bit of a miscalculation thanks to lose input there. And uh, we will go to a round three because of it. Let's see what Vex is thinking based on stage here. And we are bringing it right back to Battlefield. Um, he's probably thinking that the Pikmin did a lot more in terms of racking up damage on him, so I might thought that platforms might provide Oop, some cover. Started off with a pivot grab, jabs, grab again. Racking up air. 36 Ooh, back in the first five seconds of the round. I feel like he's gotten under Vex's skin here. Yeah, he certainly has just by the look of it. Mm. Grabbing right on it's like you're going nowhere. I'm he's, grabbing you right off the ledge. He's rushing him down. And he's just on top of Cloud. It's but this right here, this is what's good. You know, he, he knows his game plan. He has to change up the game plan. So now yeah. Alpha's on the offensive and it's throwing Vex off really bad. Exactly. These guys are adaptive, so if something now, works if the he first gets the cross time, this is it. Just chose to go for the down air spike again instead, because it worked for him before. But that like you said, cross slash would have covered a lot more options just because of that lingering. Yeah. I don't know. Should he sit safe away from the ledge? Mm. I feel like he. Ooh. Oh, oh, some of the climb hazard. <laughs> and again, that's a nice mix up that he's throwing out. Not a lot of people are expecting it, especially oh, us. Oh, man. He might have hurt himself. Back throw, stage Back presence. Two side B. Two side B. No. And he's choosing to... Oh, oh look okay. at that. Look at that. Mm. I saw that Vex, though, was uh, trying to air dodge the Pikmin uh, off stage, And that could prove a little bit troublesome for Cloud because he has trouble getting back on stage if he's far out. And if he air dodges, that animation could provide a little bit detrimental to him. <laughs> Good pressure on that shield. It's looking pretty low. My, so. my. Have anyone actually noticed? I mean... It's, it's eight minutes on the time. Yeah, I saw that in chat, and I was about to like tell them after this match was over. Yeah. So long as it concludes before we see two minutes, that's fine. Which it will. I don't, I don't see these characters. Now, if you have Pac-Man versus Al. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Gets the grab Bell. out of it, and that will take. That All right. Cool. So we are on last stock situation so, for these two. Now, what's the mental mindset? Is Vex going to be scared? Is he going to you know, be a little bit more cautious of his stock? Uh... I think he has to match him at least a little bit in just terms of rushing him in because, like, he, his play style was just, you know, rushing in and then he just, he could always fall back to the option to throw in the Pikmin. So if he matches him tit for tat for just rushing in and trying to force anything out of him, mm -hmm. it could cause a slip up on uh, Logic's now, part. Vex needs to, he's, I mean, he's probably going for, you know, limit right now. Yeah. But... Once he gets it, he needs to go in because he's going to take this, you know, a little bit of poison damage by the Pikmin. Yep. It's not going to be good at all. This will certainly help here, this edge situation. He rolls past, doesn't get the full connection with that uh, down smash. He needs to leave it alone. Leave the Pikmin alone. Yeah, he needs to right, get the kill. Exactly, because he's playing a lot more defensively because he's recognizing that Logic is uh, doing the same right now. Yeah, but it's bad if he's facing exactly. on the Pikmin. He exactly. Shouldn't. I would say, you want to throw the Pikmin on me? Go ahead. I still actually have no... I'm, I'm going to get you. I'm going to hit you with cross slash, and the game's going to be over. Should have been a couple times right there. I mean, he had the option. Oh my Throws goodness. out the blade beam, though. No! <gasps> and he went in too Vex, deep. No! What was that, Vex? Vex, what was that? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, and he's shaking his head after that. Because of that circumstance...